everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Michelle. Very nice to meet you. And if you guys are coming back, hey, what's up? So yes, you are seeing a different area of my bedroom. This is the other way, you guys. And the reason why I'm showing it is that I got a bed in a box. That is what that big long box is right there. And I'm going to open it up for you guys. And we'll see if it inflates. So this is an Oliver Smith Organic 12-inch Spring and Foam hybrid mattress. It's supposed to be plush. I got it off of Walmart for $305 and it is a hybrid uh, king mattress you guys. Um, so this sucker is heavy. So if you guys need to, if you get a bed in a box, make sure you guys have help. It's taken me two days to get this box up two flights of small stairs. It's not full long stairs. But, oh uh, yeah, my back is killing me you guys. So it is 100% natural organic, uh, cover and ventilated, it has cooling memory foam in it. It is highest rated non-toxic foam. Uh, it has pocketed 15 gauge uh, pocket foils. It's, it has a Euro pillow uh, top uh, for added softness and is 100% green foam certified. So it's gotten some really good reviews. It had gotten about a 4.1 out of 5. There was only 55 reviews on it, but the price I couldn't beat it. I did need a new mattress, and so that's what's in there. So I'm going to go ahead and try to open this thing up for you guys. Um, you might not be able to hear me as I go further away, but uh, it's supposed to spring open and pop open. So we'll see what it looks like because my back is killing me now from lugging that thing up the stairs. So let's get to it. All right. I know I look for worse for wear, so ignore what I look like. All right, so I had opened up the box prior. Can you pull from that kind of This thing is huge. It is 
is heavy. in it right over here. It's all right. But it needs to, it's not as simple as that. Oh my gosh. How, how do I get on the bed? Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> Did you see how it just popped up? This bed is huge. I know we're going to need a step stool to get on there. I Wait, think I my it. next thing is that I have a um a um, lower level on this <laughs> which is yeah there's my old old one over there that one has to go down the stairs now but that's be easier to throw down the stairs than to get it back up but did you see how that sucker popped open you got to be careful with it that's what i heard all reviews for a lot of reviews is that um it will go ahead and pop open uh, and it springs which it did I was trying to be careful not to cut the inner part, which I cut the inner part. So that's how come it attacked me. <laughs> but is it comfy? Yeah? <laughs> yes, we're not supposed to sleep on it yet. It's supposed to raise up, but the way that it looks like, it definitely has raised up. So I have a base down there. Nor it's an old base. But I'm thinking about having to get a second... Um, a smaller one for that one so that's what I'm hoping to go ahead and get but uh, until now um, this is where I'm at so but oh yeah that's a that's a really big bed yeah they have the base which they have like a smaller base I think they have like a 10 inch base so I think I'm gonna have to go ahead and pick up one of those so I can make it a little bit lower because if not we're going to be jumping up on the, <laughs> on the bed like at this. night time yes <laughs> yes to stand next to it he's almost five feet tall and it almost comes up to his waist so yeah I mean that's that's a tall bed <laughs> you guys so but we'll be getting on the bed yes I'll start from over there I'll go right <laughs> yes. <laughs> How do you get this? So I will go ahead and do another review, you guys. I'm going to add on to this. I just wanted to show you guys me opening up. You guys would have laughed watching me put it, bring it up the stairs by myself. It was hilarious. Uh, my back is killing me, and I really do need this bed to fluff up fully, which it looks like it has. I mean, I'm like amazed by it. But I will uh, go ahead and give you some more of a review on it once I slept on it for one day. And as it floats up a little bit more, if it increases in size, which I'm hoping not because that looks like it's 12 inches already. Um, and so I'll let you guys know a little bit more about the details of the bed itself and also uh, tell you how we slept on it. So I will see you guys probably tomorrow after I've had a good night's rest sleep. Or later on before I go to bed to show you what it looks like before I sleep on it. See you later, you guys. Okay, you guys. So, I have, it's been more than a day 
with the new mattress that I had went ahead and got that you saw me unboxing uh, that tried to attack me. <laughs> so I've had it for about a, almost about a week now. So I've been sleeping on it for about a week. I love my bed, you guys. For the price, like I said, I got it for $305 off of Walmart. And a little bit about more about the mattress itself. It is a uh, bed in a ba uh, box. Uh, it is king. The size is white. It does have a pillow top mattress. It's a hybrid mattress. So it has coils in it, plus it has the uh, foam on it too. It is about 113 pounds uh, for the mattress itself. And like I said, it's green foam. It's 100% green foam certified. It has a uh, independently super fly pocketed 15 gauge pocket coils. It has a Euro pillow top for added softness. Um, it's 100% natural organic. Now, like I said, this mattress fluffed up really fast. As you saw in the, the unboxing, I mean, it just popped up to the 12 inches that it's supposed to be. It is a really tall <laughs> mattress, you guys. It comes up to my waist, and I'm about 5'2", and it comes up to my waist. So I do need a step ladder to get on it. But I'm going to get the base. Um, I'm going to get that a little bit smaller, so that's going to be my next adventure to go ahead and do. So that this way it's not so high. I have uh, some of the reviews on it. People loved it, and some of the people said that they felt the springs on it. I do not feel the springs at all. I'm not a little girl, you guys, so I was a little nervous about getting a, um, a hybrid mattress, one that I didn't even feel, just because I'm not a little girl. Um, so it's able to hold my weight. It hasn't sunk down. There's no indention on it. I could go on the side. Now, would I say it has like the 100%, you know, side, you know, of the bed that it doesn't go down a little? It does go down a little, but I'm not sliding off the bed. Uh, I sleep mostly close to the edge. Like, let's say this is the end screen is the end of my bed. This is kind of like where I sleep. And my son, when he sleeps with me, he uh, has all of this. Uh, I love the weekend because then he'll go in his room and he'll sleep in there. But yeah, it's just us two. So he still sleeps in the bed with mom. <laughs> so, but uh, between the dog and him, I have a little spot in the end. And I am enjoying this bed. It is so super soft. I go in there. I Not that I sink into it, but it is so comfy. Um, somebody had asked before, uh, does it, um, do you sleep warm with it? Now, I can't really judge if I'm sleeping warm in the bed or not. I only have a portable AC unit, um, in my window, and I have a really, really big room, so it takes a very long time for my room to cool down. So, in the morning time, I'm not waking up in a sweat. Uh, it is chilly in the, the room at that point, but when I go to bed at night, I am a little hot to begin with because it's not, I don't keep the AC unit running because my central air has been gone, but I have been enjoying this bed, you guys. Um, if you're looking for a new bed, I could highly recommend this bed. Uh, it is very comfortable. I am enjoying my sleep. Now, like I said, in about another three months, I'll give you guys an update on what the bed looks like. I think I have one or two pictures of the bed all made up, so I'll pop it up over here, over here, uh, for you guys to see uh, it all made up. Uh, so, but I, I'm, I'm enjoying it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy the video. I know I looked a mess that day. I had just brought that 113-pound mattress up the stairs by myself. So, if you do get one and you live on a second story, or you have a two-story house like me, or you're bringing it up, you know, in an apartment complex and you're on the second, third floor, make sure you guys get help because that was a heavy box. So, and again, make sure when you cut it, 
be very careful because it will pop open because you saw in the video it popped up when I mean. So I am enjoying this bed, you guys. Uh, leave me comments down below. Let me know what kind of bed in a box have you gotten? Have you gotten any? If so, which brands do you like? I'm hoping this is going to last quite some time. Like I said, for $305, I was very uh, in doubt that, oh, well, hopefully it's a decent bed and it'll last me, you know, better than my old one. But Oh my gosh, I wish I had gotten this sooner, you guys. I am sleeping so well right now. So it calls my name all the time. Michelle, come sleep on me. <laughs> so I really, really enjoying this bed, you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review on the uh, opening of the bed in the box. And uh, uh, I, you know, I'm loving my bed. <laughs> so don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, you guys. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Give me a thumbs up, you guys, because it really does help my channel. It lets you two know that you're loving my or liking my videos and puts it out there so more people will come in and become friends with us here. All right, and make sure you guys are sharing me out. I would love that so much. So I hope you guys enjoy this review on my bed in a box I had gotten from Walmart, and it is the Oliver Smith Organic 12-inch Spring and Foam Mattress. Right now, they have it for a hundred, uh, $318. So this is whoop, what the bed, uh, the bed is, and that has all the information for you like I said they have different sizes and I love it you guys so I am really really enjoying this uh, bed so if you're looking for a new bed you're looking for something inexpensive check it out I hope you guys have a wonderful fabulous day I want you guys to stay safe out there and I will see you in my next video bye everybody